today I'm going to continue with the album reviews with um, a jazz rock band um, Steely Dan. So today I'm going to be talking about this will be Steely Dan's second uh, studio album. It's called Countdown to Ecstasy. Um, and this album here, it's a rock, jazz rock, and pop album. Um, so, I really, really, I really don't, well, this is me, myself, I really don't consider Steely Dan um, a pop band. Um, consider them, you know, a rock, rock band, rock jazz, you know what I mean? So you can hear kind of that jazz kind of style in their music, some of the music. Um, I don't consider them a uh, pop band, um, not even close to a pop band, I wouldn't consider them, um, um, anyways, um, this album here, Count, Countdown to Ecstasy, um, was released on July of 1973, um, so the songs on the album includes, I don't know how to pronounce that, B-O-T-H-I-S-A-T-T-V-A, However, however you pronounce it, I don't know. Um, after that is uh, Razor Boy, The Boston Rag, The 7 Minute and 2 Second Song, Your Gold Teeth, Show Biz Kids, My Old School, Pearl of the Quarter, And last is King of the World. Um, so that's only eight songs on this album, eight. So the album itself is a little over, I think a little over 40 minutes long. Um, so I say, you know, off this one, um, My Old School, that one there is a great rocking tune. Um, really good. Um, now, on this album, they had another guitar player play on it as well. Um, so on the song Show Biz Kids, that song there, um, Rick Derringer plays slide guitar on uh, on that song. Um, which, he, yeah, also, you know, he played on, oh man, he played with uh, Edgar Winter Group. Um, Johnny Winter, man, um, played with so many different musicians, um, great, great musician, I've done so many, you know, album views of, um, of, uh, Johnny Winter, if you want to check that out, um, in Edgar Winter Group, as well as I've done two, well, actually, two, um, album views of Rick Derringer's debut album, All-American Boy, and, um, Spring Fever, as well as the band that he formed in, uh, 75, 76, 76 was when their first album came out, uh, Derringer, um, as well as Sweet Evil, so I've done two album reviews of that, so if you want to check out that, check out, um, Rick Derringer, um, you just scroll down, you see that, and then if you see Derringer, that's the other band he was in, um, that he formed, um, great, great band, great rock band, um, some of his, you know, the two ones that I do have, the two studio albums, um, like I said, All American Boy, it was his first solo album, you know, since going solo, um, which is an amazing rock album, um, as well as Spring Fever, another one. Um, anyways, um, you know, there's a live performance of My Old School, if you want to check that out. Um, that's a great, great song. Um, also check out Steely Dan Can't Buy a Thrill album view um, on my channel, which I've done two, I'm trying to think, two days ago, I think it was, or something like that. Um, but um, great, great, great album. Really good. Um, excellent, excellent album. So I'll go through the songs again. Um, then I'm going to uh, go into uh, the next 
the next album that came out after after this. Um, so the songs on the album include uh, B O D H I S A T T V A. I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, Bod is of Teva. I don't know um, how. I don't know how you pr would pronounce that. Um, Razor Boy, the Boston Rag, the seven minute and two second song, Your Gold Teeth, which that's uh, the longest song on this album. Um, Show Biz Kids, My Old School. That's a great, that's a great one. Now I found on um, that there, if you watch the, um, watch the uh, music video, or live performance of, of that song, um, you can see Jeff Baxter um, later uh, play with uh, the Doobie Brothers, which had done album use that, the way he played the guitar solo in, in that, that song is just great. Um, after that, um, after that song, my old school is Pearl of the Quarter, and last is King of the World. Um, like I said, um, make sure to check out that live performance, like I said, and also um, check out Steely Dan Can't Buy a Thrill album view on my channel. Um, so, this is the second one um, that I'm doing. So I'm going to go all the way up until uh, 1977 album, because that's the last one that I do have um, of, of, um, out there. So, yeah, so um, hit a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. All you people that did so far, thank you very much for that. Um, greatly appreciate it. So I'm going to be talking about their third studio album um next so stay tuned for that and be right back bye